Hi, this is Steve Walton from Tropic Heating and PatioHeat.com. Today, I'm going to take a look at this patio. So the customer gave me the dimensions, and let me just click those on real quick. I have an overall height of 12.6, um, 28 feet from inside to inside edge here. I have the uh, window height of 7.9, and the uh, height over here at uh, 8.4. I believe the depth was, uh, I'm going to guess, 10 feet here I think uh, actually 11 feet is the depth here um, the center of this window here uh, it's actually a doorway I should say but it's uh, 15 feet 10 from the edge over here and so I think I have the overall dimension of the uh, 17 5 is the uh, width of the window here um, they do already have junction boxes up here and over here and so those are something that we need to work with. Um, I think that's about it. So what I have here is um, placing the heaters. These are 4,000 watt C, uh, C4024 model Infratech heaters. And I have them placed uh, approximately 10 feet um, center. And I just based that off of number one, um, this seating positions this is the two seating positions that the uh, customer is looking for you have a seating position here and a seating position over here and so let's just look at the ray i'm going to turn off that dimension the ray here you can see with these two heaters that uh, our coverage is not ideal um, i have a nice coverage over here on this side of the table now this ray will extend out and um, you will feel the warmth but it's not the ideal warmth that you're looking for over here so if it's a kind of a dual um, personality I guess where you have some people that are colder and some people that are feel warmer then it's okay um, but you can see that the coverage here um, is fairly well from left to right here but not the depth itself <clears throat> now it's true also with this uh, couch over here um, we got the same issue going along and of course with the uh, seats over here these aren't really being penetrated whatsoever so that's a possible issue for this customer now you might ask why I didn't move this heater further to the right closer to the edge of the window here and the reason why is um, I do need to meet the 18-inch uh, clearance above this heater. And let's just show what that would kind of look like. So this 18-inch clearance, um, <clears throat> this um, kind of lobe over here will show that. And if I was to move the heater, whoa, sorry about that. If I was to move the heater um, to the right, then I would start penetrating the ceiling over here and I'm trying to avoid that penetration you can see over here how that penetrates and so what I've done is just got to the very 18 inch edge and um, that helps me from uh, penetrating the ceiling with that 18 inch clearance so so another option uh, or an additional option which I don't think this customer has but um, what I would like to see is heaters out here. Um, you could possibly turn this angle a little bit stronger than the 60 degrees that the manufacturer recommends and um, get a better coverage. Um, you could also move this heater out further away from this wall so that um, you get that better coverage and then change the angle um, of the heater but you're still not going to capture the uh, seating area on this outside edge with just the uh, one side option so sort of like this here so but these are 4,000 watts you could put a 6,000 watt unit up here if you have the power um, 4,000 watts I believe is 17 point uh, 6 amps or sorry 16.7 amps and then the the uh, 6,000 watt units would be 25 amps a piece and um, so in any case there you have it that's what I would recommend that this customer does um, I just kind of I know that this customer is already anticipating something that's very similar to this 
um, but I wanted to make sure that uh, we met clearances before we made any type of recommendations. So if you have questions or if you need some help with your outdoor heating application, please give me a call or just email me your request at uh, support at patioheat.com. And I'm Steve Walton. Thank you very much and have a great day.